What's your power bill like if you drive a Tesla? Well, I don't know, but let's find out. On average, Americans drive about 1,200 miles every month. Let's say the car gets about 30 miles per gallon. And the gas price today in America is about $3.63. Well, let's tweak the competition a little bit. Let's say it's about $3.20 today. So if you drive 1,200 miles each month, you burn about 40 gallons of gasoline with a 30 mile per gallon car. At about $3.20 per gallon, your monthly fuel expense is about $128. Well, let's look at my wife's Tesla Model 3 long range. It has a 75 kilowatt hour battery, and based on the car, my wife is currently getting about 224 watt hour per mile power efficiency on average. Again, let's bend the bar a little bit. Well, if she drives 1200 miles every month at 250 watt hour per mile, it requires about 300,000 watt hour, which is 300 kilowatt hour. And my local power company charges just under 13 cents per kilowatt hour. But let's say that's 13 cents per kilowatt hour to make the math easier. So at 13 cents per kilowatt hour, 300 kilowatt hour would cost you about $39. Which means if my wife drives about 1200 miles each month, it costs about $39 each month to run the car. A delta of $89 per month comparing to that 30 mile per gallon car. And if you want to do the math, Tesla Model 3 long range is about 3.28 times more efficient than a car with 30 miles per gallon of gas efficiency. Well, I did favor the gas car a little bit here. So if we change these numbers to the real numbers, in the state where I'm from, gas is about $3.25 per gallon. Yeah, that's Alabama for you. No, I'm not from Mississippi. And yes, there are Asians in Alabama. Roll Tide. Using the real power efficiency, which is 224 watt hour per mile, and the discounted charging rate, because I charge the car at night during off peak hours, it actually only costs about $29 each month. If my wife drives 1200 miles every month, a delta of $99 per month. And for those haters out there, let me show you my power bill. But before that, you need to know this. I do have three HVAC units at my house, electric water heater, two fridges, an electric stove in the basement, a hot tub that I keep it hot all year round. Also, my house is about 3,300 square feet and built in 1968. Actually, a pretty drafty house. But I do have dual pane windows and spray foam insulation in the attic, partially. And here are my power bills from the last year. And there's one thing I forgot to tell you about. I actually own two Teslas. My wife's Model 3 Long Range and my Model X, which is way less efficient. And just for fun, if we run the numbers for my Model X, which let's say 1200 miles times about 400 watt hour per mile, which means I use about 480 kilowatt hour per month at 13 cents per kilowatt hour. That is just over $62 each month. Comparing to that 30 mile per gallon car, it still has a delta of $65.6. I'm doing the math still favoring the gas car. It is still more than twice as efficient as the other gas car with 30 miles per gallon gas mileage. And my Model X could be a seven seater. It is six seater though. It's over 6,000 pounds, a way heavier car. It's a huge SUV that can tow over 5,000 pounds. So what do you say? And one more thing for your haters out there. I did have to spend over $3,000 last month to repair my Model X. It's not transmission. It's not an engine. It's not a battery. Oil leak.